Hello everybody, welcome to another great episode of Hillbilly Select Reviews, where I review everything that has anything to do with alcohol, okay, beers, wines, liquors, liqueurs, I do some teas, I do famous Sunday morning coffee reviews, I do it all broken down in the playlist that you will find amazing, believe me. Even if you don't like what I review, which I can't see how all the stuff I review, you don't like any of it, but you have friends that do. And family, and you're going to want to buy them gifts. And I'm going to give you the ideas you never thought of. Check out that playlist. You'll see. Today we're going to do a shootout, if you will. I'm going to do Sheedland Irish Cream. All right, there it is. Versus, uh, wouldn't it be great if that actually, there it is. Sheedland Irish Cream versus, where is it? Cavanaugh Irish Cream. All right. Versus... Bailey's Irish Cream. Let's talk about them as fast as we can. Sheelin is pretty much made for Total Wine. Uh, they all are imported from Ireland. Sheelin is 13.9% alcohol by volume. The other two are 17%. Alright. Um, all of them are made with Irish cream, Irish whiskey, cocoa, Different things added to them. So the original one from 1974 is the Bailey's, and uh, here it is. All right. So I'm gonna pour. Uh, obviously, I'm gonna pour them. Let's do the Sheelin first. Um, yeah, Sheelin first. And there's the color. And then we will do the Cavanaugh. All right. Exact same color, and last but not least, the bellies. And I should do this blind, but I'm by myself. So, and again, I'm just going to compare. Pretty much identical. Okay, so here we go. We will smell the Sheelin. Very chocolatey cocoa. Almost more of a creamy smell. The cocoa, maybe vanilla. Bailey's, now I'm going reverse. Cavanaugh, and then the Sheila. More of a candy type. Candy type smell. Alright, so. Let's try the uh, try the uh, Sheelin first. I have done reviews of these separately, so I'm not going to go into them too much because I've done a separate review of every one of these, which is more in depth. I'm just comparing to see what one's better and why. Got that, and I've got that. Got an almond taste to it too. And that was the uh, Kavanaugh. All right. I'm going to bring this down to the Kavanaugh versus the Baileys. And I did Kavanaugh and Baileys. Now I'm going to do Baileys and then Kavanaugh. Nice cocoa. Same ABV, 17%. Nice creaminess on the um, Baileys. Caramel vanilla. It's a tie. The uh, Bellies has a little more cocoa taste, a little more chocolate. The other one has a little more caramel vanilla uh, taste to it. Both of them have the same creaminess, same alcohol, same flavor. I think the Cavanaugh is a lot less expensive. Um, if you liked a little more of the chocolate, the other one. If you like a little more of the vanilla and the uh, caramel type flavor, uh, then you would do the Cavanaugh as opposed to the Bellies. Uh, I think the Cavanaugh is a lot cheaper than the Bailey's, and for the price, I would go with the Cavanaugh because it is very good. Just a slight difference in the flavor profile when tasted side by side. The Sheelins, I believe, is the least expensive at all as, uh, of all, but um, you know, I don't. I would go with at least the Cavanaugh then 
over the over the sheet ones. I wasn't crazy about the sheet. From Hillbilly Select Reviews, everybody, I hope you enjoyed that comparison. And as always, don't forget to subscribe, comment the whole nine yards, you know, so the analytics pushes me out there. Because I can't be the greatest YouTube channel in the world if you don't help me. <laughs> That's obvious. So, from Hillbilly Select Reviews, everybody, I will see you all on the next one.